Let's wind up this topic in this lecture. Before solving the repeated operation problems, let's understand the concept behind it. First suppose a vessel contains x units of certain liquid and from which certain amount let's say y units are taken out. And finally replaced with water. If this particular process happens n number of times then quantity of liquid can be determined by x into 1 minus y by x or n. Now solution becomes easy. A container contains 40 liters of milk. From this container 4 liters of milk was taken out and replaced with water. This process was repeated further two times. How much milk is now contained in the container? Let's solve this. From the first statement, the container actually contained 40 liters of milk. So, x is equal to 40 and 4 liters was taken out. Therefore, y is equal to 4 and that was replaced with water. And repetition of this operation took two more times. The third statement suggests that this process was repeated further two times. It means that it has already happened once and it also happened further two times. Therefore, the number of operations is 3. He is asking for how much milk is contained in the container. Therefore, it means that it is quantity of milk in the container. And how do we determine the quantity of milk? By using the formula. That is, quantity is equal to x into 1 minus y by x or n. We know the values and we need to substitute. Therefore, 40 into 1 minus 4 by 40 or 3. On simplification, you will be getting 40 into 9 by 10 whole cube and this on simplification, you will be getting 29.16 liters. That's it. Hope you have understood this concept. Prepare and perform well. Thank you.